a viewer had recently asked a question no my baby has one side testicle absent is it a problem what should i do let us see the answer in today's video hi friends i am dr karamat this is scientific doctor channel in this channel every week there is a video released on health health related queries on nutrition if you want to see such videos kindly subscribe to this channel and if you have any queries or videos which needs to be addressed to kindly put it in the links below i'll try to make videos on them subsequently this week's video is about undescended testis okay you have testicles which are there in the scrotal sac you have a pair okay both sided testis but embryologically when you are formed the testicles are not formed in the scrotal sac they are formed in the abdomen during the last months of pregnancy they descend down into the scrotum so if your baby is born preterm it is very logical that they may be still in the abdomen they will subsequently descend down okay and due to some hormonal reasons or maternal hormonal reasons or mechanical reasons or environmental reasons some persons can have an undescended testicle either on one side or both sides is this a problem for us to understand whether this is a problem we have to understand first why god or nature has designed testicles to lie outside the human body in the scrotal sac for optimum sperm production the testicles need to be cooler than the body temperature at least by 2 to 3 degrees that's why god bar nature has designed it to descend and lie outside if you left the testis to be there in the abdomen in the body temperature your sperm production and quality will take a hit so you can have problems of infertility if the testis are left in the abdomen especially if it is bilateral even if it is one sided you can have problems related to fertility also a testis lying in the body temperature is more prone for cancerous changes you can have testicular cancer more than what is there when the testis is outside the body if it is left inside the abdomen so there is increased risk of cancer you can also have other problems like hernia a groin hernia or you can have testicular torsion testicular torsion can happen even to the testis which are there in the scrotal sac but because it is evident outside you can easily diagnose but if testicular torsion happens to the testis which is inside the abdomen it is difficult to diagnose it is very difficult to treat so for these reasons these are the problems which can arise if the testis is left inside the abdomen so you have to make it come outside okay this is clear as i said preterms have around 20 to 30% risk of undescended testis when they are born even term infants at least 3% have the risk of undescended testis so it is very easy to diagnose so it is obvious so whenever a newborn is born it needs to be examined by a pediatrician so that he is able to identify these problems so for any reason you identify it later we need to seek where the testis is you can do it via ultrasound or an mri examination sometimes rarely via laparoscopy where the testicle is located okay whether it should be brought down how it should be brought down you have medical means like you can give hormones and bring it down or you have surgical means when should it be done beyond 3 months a testicle is unlikely to descend on its own so treatment becomes necessary so if the medical that is hormonal treatment fails surgical treatment becomes mandatory and this should not be probably delayed beyond 6 months 6 months to 1 year of age depending upon the weight of the baby anesthetic fitness of the baby it should not be delayed beyond 6 months of age what is done is a surgery called archaeopexy where the testis are brought and anchored to the scrotum sometimes very rarely testis was present in both the scrotal sacs normally in childhood but when you become older sometimes the testis is hidden 
it is there sticking with the body this is called retractile testis if you squat sometimes it can come or you can mechanically bring it out into the scrotum this is not a problem this is called retractile testis but if your entire testis is missing from one side or both sides it is essential to meet your doctor especially if the child is more than three months of age and get it corrected get it investigated get it analyzed and get it treated properly hopefully this would have cleared your doubts regarding this topic if you found this video useful kindly share it among your friends and relatives if you want to see such videos subscribe to this channel till we meet again bye